Well, good morning. It is David George Brook, that gratitude guy, with the daily gratitude news for Tuesday, July 14th. And I thought in the news today would be a good example of just focusing on five or six things to be grateful for that we maybe take for granted and uh, don't think about as often as we should. So uh, with today's news, I thought take a moment today to reflect on these things as you listen to the news around gratitude. Number one, being alive. George Burns often joked in his later years that a great day for him was waking up and not seeing candles, hearing church music, and seeing people attending his funeral. Number two, nature and natural beauty. No matter where you live, there are natural things to look at and appreciate. Rainbows, fluffy clouds, and blue skies, the fresh smell of ocean air, the warmth of the sun on a cool day, and the coolness of a breeze or a rain shower on a hot afternoon are all things you can appreciate and enjoy. A home and shelter. Many people take this for granted. Look around most cities and you'll see people whose homes are cars, cardboard boxes, bridge underpasses, or shelters. Abundant food to eat. You have a huge selection of good, inspected, healthy food to buy from numerous sources anytime. Friends. So many people are totally alone. And during this pandemic, that's even more so than ever before. If you have a friend and even kind neighbors, you are better off than many people. Lastly, living in a democratic society. Politics aside, most of the world lives in a country where people can have rights such as voting and freedom to worship and many, many other freedoms. So just some things to think about in the news today about how gratitude will totally help you focus on what you have versus what you don't have. Something they say all the time, gratitude turns what you have into enough. It's so important. It's like the ultimate scene, the glass half full. It'll totally reframe and refocus your attitude. That's the gratitude news for today. We'll see you tomorrow.